Welcome to the Estadio Benito Villa Marín, where the action will soon get underway. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Real Betis, and they take on Osasuna. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. We are... Well, here's the Betis starting 11. Rui da Silva begins between the posts. Herman Petzela plays alongside Bartra in central defence. Canales plays with Juanmi on the flanks. And the central striker is Borja Iglesias. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, it can be seen as a very defensive shape, but if they have good athletes in midfield, which they have, who are ready to break forward as soon as possession is won, they can still pose a big threat today. And so the match is underway. Fekia. Well, tremendous block. Safe, but still a chance. Just wanted to get it out of there. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Well, so close to seeing an early goal here. It's a... Oh, could be! And a goal! Not bad for starters! They take an early lead! Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, they've given him too much space, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. German Pezzella. They've won back possession. Juan Cruz the ball with Lucas Toro and the body in the way running with the ball confidently oh he's missed it well he'd be very disappointed with that he should be scoring from there William Carvalho Canales It's with William Carvalho Fekia But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending Toro 
Brazanats now. Into the advanced position. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. David Garcia. Can they get in behind them? He takes aim. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Committed challenge. Canales. Really good attacking play. Chance to cross. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Defensive efficiency personified. Uh, can they create something? Juan Cruz. Ruben Garcia. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. He has time to play it over. He read the situation defensively and did his job. William Carvalho. Borja Iglesias. And taken away, he won the ball. Goalkeeping. Now the delivery, and cleared away, excellent challenge, so a throw in here, Andres Guardado, Alex Moreno, Moving the ball forward with purpose. And he's got the beating of his opponent. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Who can he pick out? And did his job defensively. Chance here. Able to close down the shot. And across the byline, a goal kick as a result. foul play and as a result a free kick forthcoming Guardado tremendous block might still be able to do but the crossbar got in the way the first half here comes to an end
On a positive first half performance by Borja Iglesias, what did you make of what he put into the game? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Nacho Vidal Moncayola it's a weighted pass and possession given away so a corner kick it'll be following the deflection Can someone get on the end of this? Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. And in the end, no damage done. High pressing at its best. They're making high. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And over comes the corner. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Hector Bellerin. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. And teammates to play it to. Oh, great defending. David Garcia Brazanats now and they continue to advance and a lot of options here 30 minutes left for play opportunity in the wide area and it's gone in just what the doctor ordered Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So 2-0 now. We're getting the ball forward. Takes the shot. Body in the way. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Ezekiel Avila. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball. Now, far from a smooth challenge. Now, will the referee produce a card? And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking.
he's going to be disappointed with that pass 20 minutes remaining and he's in tenacious tackling excellent defending there He could pick out a teammate. Now, this could really lift spirits. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, it looked so threatening, but the danger averted. Useful looking position, you've got to say. A chance to whip it in. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Counter-attacking very much an option. Well, it fizzled out. Good-looking sequence. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Defensive efficiency personified. No nonsense clearance. Well, on the cusp of the final whistle and the home side really prospering today. Stuart, interested to get your take. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. Possession one. And the pass could do damage. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. And possibilities here. Attending to his defensive chores. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. And to Budimir. Oh, big chance! And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. <laughs> and over comes the corner. And a goal! They've cut into the lead! It's not settled yet! Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, we tend to expect production from Borja Iglesias, and that's what we got. How would you sum up his contribution, Stuart? Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most. And with a bit more luck, he could have had a second one today.